Okay, hello guys, welcome to Easy Tech Solutions. My name is Michael. So, in this video, I will show you how hackers use this particular uh, fake um, crypto image sender to steal unsuspecting users' wallet information. Okay, so I'll be showing you um, the various steps that they take to achieve um, that, this particular phishing um, scam. Okay, so basically what they do is that they, they get their victim um, email. Okay, so and they try to find out the particular wallet that the user is using. Okay, so after doing that, they will come over to this um, particular website then they will you know um send fake um crypto transaction like a deposit has been made into um that particular account okay let's say um if you are sending btc you can see the amount of um two btc has been credited into your account so click here to you know view transaction so once the uh, user click on that particular link it will be directed to the um phishing page okay so that is the phishing page of that particular website so if it's blockchain so it will be directed to phishing page of blockchain so once he enter his um, login information so the information will be sent back to this particular image sender okay so in this video i'll be showing you exactly how it work so i'll be revealing everything to you and you know how and also so that you know how to secure and then protect yourself in case you come across something like this all right so thank you very much if today is your first time of coming across our video please subscribe to our youtube channel and click on the notification bell so stay tuned as we start the video fully so this is the image sender web app so once you are able to um get to this particular session of it you have to you know log in all right so you log in so let's log in now okay so we'll log in all right so this is the dashboard this is where you're able to send um the users fake um bitcoin fake um ethereum fake usdt and so on okay so this is where you're able to make the you know sending of fake um crypto transactions all right so and on this other side of it you can see all logs okay so this is where you go to uh, see all um users information so once they try to log in through your link so this is where you go to see their um account uh, username or email address their account password then the account type okay so this is where you go to um, see their information if they try to log in using the um using the link okay so you're able to get their information here and go over to that particular website and log in then you can do whatever you want with their account okay so what we we'll do now is that we are going to send a um fake um, crypto transaction to my email address so that we all see how this particular um email sender work okay so let's say for example we are sending bitcoin let's say we are sending um we are sending hundred thousand okay hundred thousand btc so we have to check the equivalent equivalent amount in a btc so let's do something like this okay so let's check the amount in bitcoin okay so this is the amount we have in um, 2.90 so come over here and um, paste okay so let's see this particular user is using a um, binance account okay so if the user is using binance you select binance here if the user is using coinbase you select coinbase if it's using blockchain you select blockchain yes and if it's using um cracking so you select that here also so let's say this particular user is using binance okay so and we are sending bitcoin okay so if you want to send ethereum you can select ethereum here if you want to send um, um bnb you send you select bnb here. if you are sending usdt so you select usdt here as well okay let's say we are sending bitcoin 
then the select country so let's say from usa then the coin address okay so we have to put in the the user wallet address here or you can you can put anything here you can really put um any wallet address here so let's say let me just type anything as the wallet address so if, even if you don't have the user wallet address you can as well type anything here so it will not show so let's say um this is the user email so this is my email actually so let's say this is the user email we are sending it to copy it and paste it also okay so we are sending um, 100,000 watts of BTC and the user is using a, a Binance account okay so so this is the wallet then this is the user email address so after filling this session like this so you click on generate transaction okay see transaction generated okay so transaction generated so we'll go over to the email address now so this is the email um, i logged in the email on this particular browser also so let's refresh now okay so this is the mail right now so we are seeing it it's a new transaction okay it's a new transaction so let's open this particular mail now and see okay so he said as you can see this particular me it looks similar to that that of binance so you see this particular section that saves you transaction so we'll click on this particular session now to view on the transaction okay so it, it has redirected us to um binance login page okay so the user now we have to you know provide uh, his um binance email or phone number then password so that we're able to view this transaction okay so let's um let's do something like this okay so let's say this is the user email then the password let's use one two three four five six seven eight nine zero okay so let's click on submit okay so once the user puts the information and click on submit you will see the page we automatically re reload all right so it will automatically reload the page mind you this this information which the user has entered have been sent to this particular um site for us to view the information we just entered so we'll come over here now and click on all logs okay so this is where we'll see the information so as you can see this is the email address we entered and then this is the password okay so we selected um binance account so that's why you are seeing account type is showing binance over here all right so what we'll do right now let's delete this um, this transaction then we'll, we'll try blockchain um transaction so okay so let's let's try a blockchain transaction now so let's see we are hundred thousand okay so we'll come over here so we'll select this one 2.90 um, btc they will come here now and select blockchain okay so let's let's select gemina then our wallet address so you know as, as i said earlier wallet address is not that um important so you can you can actually put anything here okay so because it will not show on the on the uh, mail all right so the most important thing is the email address so we'll select this email address here then we'll select it then come over and generate transaction okay so i think i i tried it twice so let's go by now so this is the um transaction new transaction so as you can see it said new transaction blockchain.com payment received 2.90 which is equivalent to um 100 000 usd a payment has been received in your blockchain wallet to view the details of your transaction on blockchain click the link below all right so let's come over here now and click the link okay so you can see the um blockchain login page now it's quite different from the 
the Binance. So this one is for the Binance um, login page, and this one is for the blockchain login page. So you know, as I said earlier, depending on the there is the wallet address you selected. So that's how the login page um, is going to um, look. Okay. So as you can see, this is exactly how um, blockchain.com login page is. So that's why you've seen it showing something like this so that the user will not doubt okay so the user will not be doubting the you know the login page so let's um enter the wallet address now let's say enter wallet address so let's say um wallet id so let's say these are wallet id okay then the password let's just enter 00009999 okay so let's say this is our password so let's click on continue okay so you see the page will automatically uh, reload so it will not take the client anywhere okay so but mind you those information has already been sent to the uh the main sender okay so let's go over there now and view the message so we'll come over here like this then we'll click on all logs okay so this is what we enter so let this is the um the wallet id that we entered and this is the password we selected and as you can see over here it's showing account type it's showing blockchain so that you will not be confused all right so this is awesome guys this is awesome so this is uh, actually what uh, what they use to you know steal people's um, wallet information you know once they receive that message telling them that um social amount have been credited into their binance account into their blockchain account so you will kind of be you know anxious to go over there and you know log in so that you're able to view the transaction so by so doing not unknowingly to the client that his information has already been hijacked by the scammer okay so that's exactly how this particular um email sender fake um crypto email sender work all right so this is a very uh awesome tools all right so in case you need something like this so as you can see we have a binance and coin blockchain account and then cry account. so you can actually use it to send um message okay let's let's try this coinbase let's use coinbase so select coinbase Let's see, we are sending 100,000. You can actually send any amount, okay? So you can send any amount. So let's see now, we want to send them um, Ethereum. So let's say this is our wallet address. Then you select the email also. So let me select this email. Okay, then I'll click on generate transaction. okay so let's go over to the main now so this is the message this is the main okay so as you can see it said in uh, 2.90 ethereum which is equivalent to 100,000 usd you you just received 2.90 ethereum which is equivalent to 100,000 usd from an external btc account it may take up to three network confirmation before your ethereum is available for trade so you see sign in to view transaction okay so let's click here now so automatically it will redirect it to the coinbase login page so which will require he or she to you know enter his um, um email address and the password okay by so doing this particular site will send it to um the um scammer all right or the hacker so let's let's do that now so let me just do something like this so admin at admin.com so let me just use uh 00985 okay let me just select any random password so and click on continue okay so let's go over to the site now and click on all logs okay so this is it so that's how this particular uh, image sender work. All right. So in case you need um, something like this, so you can actually contact us with the number showing on us on your screen. So you can reach out to us on WhatsApp. 
so we'll be glad to you know build something like this for you all right so thank you very much for watching this far and if today is your first time of coming across our video please do not forget to subscribe and click on the notification bell all right so thank you very much